Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Supplications of the Hajj. The supplications below are taken from the book Al Athkar by Imam al Nawawi. Entering Ihram. One should enter Ihram after performing a ghusl, a ritual bath, with Athkar and supplications related to the acts of purification. The pilgrim then prays two rak'ah prayer cycles of salah, reading Qul Ya Ayyuwal Kafirun in the first and Qul Huwallahu Ahad in the second after reading the Fatiha. One then intends to perform the Hajj by saying, Nawaitu al Hajj wa ahramtu bihi lillahi azza wa jal. I intend to perform the Hajj and have sanctified myself for it. It is also good if one says the following, Allahumma laka ahram nafsi wa sha'ari wa bashari wa lahmi wa dammi. O oh Allah, I have sanctified myself, my hair, my skin, my flesh and my blood. One then reads the Talbiyah, the call of response. Labbaik Allahumma labbaik, labbaik la sharika laka labbaik, inna alhamda wa ni'mata laka wal mulk la sharika lak. I am yours, O Allah, I am yours. You have no partner. All praise is due to you. To you belongs everything and therein you have no partner. With the very first call of the Talbiyah, immediately after making intention, one may say, لبيك اللهم بحج لبيك لبيك لا شريك لك لبيك إن الحمد والنعمة لك والملك لا شريك لك I am yours, O Allah, I am yours, coming to perform the Hajj. You have no partner. All praise is due to you. To you belongs everything and therein you have no partner. One continues reading the Talbiyah call until one reaches the Kaaba, the sacred house. It is Sunnah for a male to raise his voice when making Talbiyah. Both males and females should follow the third talbiyah with salawat al nabi salutations upon the Prophet, dua, supplication, especially asking for Allah's pleasure, Ridwan, and his garden, the Jannah. After entering Makkah and seeing the Kaaba, when the pilgrim enters the sacred city, the pilgrim says, Allah mahada haramuk wa amanuk wa harimni ala nar wa ammani min adabik yawma tab'atu ibadak. وَجَعَلَنِي مِنْ أَوْلِيَائِكَ وَأَهْلِ طَاعَتِكَ O oh Allah, this is your sanctuary and place of safety. So sanctify me by preventing me from entering the fire and make me safe from your punishment on the day on which you resurrect your slaves and make me of your friends and the people of your obedience. Then one should supplicate for whatever one wishes. It is said that the heavens open when one sees the house of God for the first time. One should say, اللهم زد هذا البيت تشريفاً وتعظيماً وتكريماً ومهابةً وزد من شرفه وكرمه من من حجه أو اتمره تشريفاً وتكريماً وتعظيماً وبراً O oh Allah, increase this house in honor, greatness, dignity and awe and increase whoever among those who make pilgrimage to it honors it and dignifies it in honor, dignity, greatness and righteousness. And Allahumma anta salam wa minka salam hayyana rabbana bis salam O oh Allah, you are peace. From you is peace. Enliven us with peace. And then one supplicates for whatever they want. The tawaf, circumambulation of the Kaaba. One begins the tawaf at the black stone. One greets it saying, Bismillahi, wallahu akbar, Allahumma imanan bika, wa tasdikan bikitabika. ووفاء بأهدك واتباعا لسنة نبيك صلى الله عليه وسلم بسم الله والله أكبر اللهم إيمانا بك وتصديقا بكتابك ووفاء بأهدك واتباعا لسنة نبيك صلى الله عليه وسلم In the name of Allah, Allah is greatest. O oh Allah, with faith in you, with belief in your book, fulfilling your covenant and following the way of your Prophet upon him be peace. One repeats this at the beginning of each circumambulation. It is sunnah to say in the first three circumambulations, Allahumma j'alahu hajjan mabrura, wa thamban maghfura, wa sa'yan mashkura. O oh Allah, make it an unblemished pilgrimage, with sins forgiven, and a feat of gratitude. And in the last four, to say, Allah maghfir warham, wa'fu amma ta'lam, wa anta al-a'azzu wal-akram. Allahumma rabbana atina fid dunya hasana 
وفي الآخرة حسنة وقنا عذاب النار Oh Allah, forgive and show mercy Pardon that which you know You are the most mighty and most honorable O oh Allah, our Lord, grant us in goodness in this world and goodness in the next and keep us from the punishment of the fire. Hassan al-Basri says that the last supplication is recommended in at least 15 places in the pilgrimage, including the Sa'i, at Mina, at Arafat, at Muzdalifat, and when stoning the Jamarat. Imam al-Shafi'i says that the last supplication should be read throughout the pilgrimage. He also said that it is preferable to read Quran in the Tawaf. After the Tawaf, the pilgrim should pray two rak'ah of prayer and make the following supplication. Allahumma, ana abduka, wa ibn abdika, ataituka bi dhunubin kathira, wa a'malin sayyia, wa hadha maqam al-a'idhi bika min al-nar, faghfir li, innaka anta al-ghafoor al-rahim. O Allah, I am your slave, the child of your slave. I have come with many sins and bad actions, and this is the station that lifts from the fire. So forgive me, for you are the all-forgiving, all-merciful. If it is possible, the pilgrim should go to the Hijr of Ismail and pray and supplicate at the Multazim, which is between the black stone and the door of the Kaaba. The Sa'i. The Sa'i is performed by moving between the foot of the hill of Safa and the foot of the hill of Marwa. One starts at Safa and ends at Marwa after moving between the two hills seven times. It is sunnah to prolong the standing of Safa and Marwa, glorify Allah and say, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Walillahi alhamd, Allahu Akbar ala ma hadana, Alhamdulillahi ala ma awlana, La ilaha illallah wahda, La sharika la, Lahu al-mulk, Walahu alhamd, Yuhyi wa yumit, Biyadihi al-khayr, Wa huwa ala kulli shayin qadir, La ilaha illallah, أنجز وعده ونصر عبده وهزم الأحزاب وحده لا إله إلا الله ولا نعبد إلا إياه مخلصين له الدين ولو كره الكافرون اللهم إنك كلت أدعوني أستجب لكم وإنك لا تخلف الميات وإني أسألك كما هديتني للإسلام ألا تنزعه مني حتى توفاني وأنا مسلم Allah is greatest, Allah is greatest, Allah is greatest. To Allah belongs all praise, or Allah is greatest in that He guided us. All praise is to Allah over what He has entrusted us. There is no God but Allah alone without partner. To Him belongs the whole dominion and all praise. He brings to life and causes death. Goodness is in His hands and He is over all things powerful. There is no God but Allah. He fulfilled His promise, assisted His slave, and destroyed the parties alone. There is no God but Allah, and we worship not but He. Sincerely, with the entire religion belonging to Him, even if the disbelievers abhor it. O oh Allah, You said and Your words are true. Call me, and I will answer You. And surely You would not break Your promise. So I therefore ask You, to just as You guided us to Islam, to not take it from me, so that it remains intact, and I die as a Muslim. When one is moving between the two hills, one should read, رَبِّ اغْفِرْ وَارْحَمْ وَتَجَاوَزْ أَمَّا تَعْلَمْ إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ الْأَعَزَّ وَالْأَكْرَمْ اللَّهُمَّ آتِنَا فِي الدُّنْيَا حَسَنَةً وَفِي الْآخِرَةِ حَسَنَةً وَقِنَا عَذَابَ النَّارِ O oh Allah, forgive. Show mercy. Overlook that which you certainly know, for you are the most mighty yet most generous. O oh Allah, grant us in goodness in this world and in the goodness in the next, and keep us from the punishment of the fire. One of the supplications of the Sa'i, which is appropriate in every place, is, Allahumma ya muqallib al-qulub, thabbit qalbi ala dinik. Allahumma inni as'aluka mujibati rahmatik, wa aza'im maghfiratik, wa salamata min kulli ithm, wal fawza bil jannah, wa najata min al-nar. Allahumma inni as'aluka al-huda, wa al-tuqa, wa al-afaf, والغناء اللهم أعني على ذكرك وشكرك وحسن إبادتك اللهم إني أسألك من الخير كله ما علمت منه وما لم أعلم وعوذ بك من الشر كله ما علمت منه وما لم أعلم وأسألك الجنة وما قرب إليها من قول وعمل 
وعوذ بك من النار وما قرب إليها من قول أو أمل O oh Allah, O oh turner of hearts, make my heart firm upon your religion. O oh Allah, I ask you those things that necessitate your mercy and lead to your forgiveness and safety from every sin and the prize of the garden and deliverance from the fire. O oh Allah, I ask you for guidance, righteousness, purity and wealth. O oh Allah, assist me in your remembrance, expression of gratitude to you and to your worship. O oh Allah, I ask you for every good, that which I know of, and that which I do not. And I seek refuge in you from all evil, that which I know of, and that which I do not. And I ask you for the garden, and all words and deeds which bring me close to it. And I seek refuge in you from the fire, and all words and deeds which bring me close to it. After completing the sa'i, one leaves the state of ihram by cutting one's hair, or shaving in the case of men. This completes the umrah. If one is only performing the Hajj, one does not have to perform Sa'i as the Tawaf will be sufficient. One should leave Makkah on the 8th of Dhul Hijjah and travel to Minna. And when leaving for Minna, one should say, Allahumma, iyaka arju, walaka ad'u, fabalighni saliha amali, waghfirli dhunubi, wamnun alayya bima mananta bihi ala ahli ta'atik, innaka ala kulli shay'in qadir. O oh Allah, in you I place my hope, and upon you I call. Allow me to fulfill my righteous aspirations, forgive my sins, bless me, as you bless the people of your obedience. You have power over all things. When leaving for Arafat from Minna, one should say, Allahumma ilayka tawajjahtu, wa wajhaka al-kareema aradtu, faj'al dhanbi maghfura, wa hajji mabrura, wa rahamni, وَلَا تُحَيِّبْنِي إِنَّكَ عَلَى كُلِّ شَيْءٍ قَدِيرٍ To you I direct my face, and your noble countenance is what I want. Make my sins forgiven, and my hajj a blessed one. Show me mercy, and do not leave me empty-handed. You have power over all things. The most important supplication on Arafat is, لَا إِلَهَ إِلَّا اللَّهُ وَحْدَهُ لَا شَرِيكَ لَهُ لَهُ الْمُلْكِ وَلَهُ الْحَمْدُ وَهُوَ عَلَى كُلِّ شَيْءٍ قَدِيرٌ There is no God but Allah, alone without partner. To Him belong the dominion and all praise, and He has power over all things. It is also narrated that the prayer that the Prophet upon him be peace made most on Arafat was, اللهم لك الحمد كالذي نقول وخيرا مما نقول اللهم لك صلاتي ونسكي ومحياي ومماتي وإليك مآلي ولك رب تراثي اللهم إني أعوذ بك من عذاب القبر ووسوسة الصدر وشتات الأمر اللهم إني أعوذ بك من شر ما تجيء به الريح O oh Allah, to you is all praise I make and better than the praise I offer To you belongs my prayer and my sacrifice From you, O oh my Lord, is my legacy O oh Allah I seek refuge in you from the punishment of the grave and the whisperings of the breast and the disintegration of the affair. O oh Allah, I seek refuge with you from all evil that comes with the wind. One should busy oneself with supplication on Arafat. Among the prayers that should be read in all places in the Hajj is Allahumma atina fid dunya hasana wa fil akhirati hasana wa qina adhab an O oh Allah, grant me goodness in this world and goodness in the next. Allah says about these days, فَإِذَا أَفَضْتُمْ مِنْ عَرَفَاتٍ فَاذْكُرُوا اللَّهُ عِنْدَ الْمَشْعَرِ الْحَرَامِ وَاذْكُرُوهُ كَمَا هَدَاكُمْ وَإِنْ كُنْتُمْ مِنْ قَبْلِهِ لَمِنَ الضَّالِّينَ ثُمَّ أَفِيدُوا مِنْ حَيْثُ أَفَاضَ النَّاسِ وَاسْتَغْفِرُوا اللَّهَ إِنَّ اللَّهَ غَفُورٌ رَحِيمٌ Then, when ye pour down from Mount Arafat, celebrate the praises of Allah at the sacred monument, and celebrate His praises as He has directed you, even though before this you went astray. Al-Baqarah, verse 198. This verse refers to flowing from Arafat toward Muzdalifah, where one spends the night in worship, and then moving to the hill known as Al-Mash'ar al-Haram in the morning. When leaving Arafat, and during the rest of the night, it is recommended to read the Talbiyah, read Qur'an, and to supplicate and make remembrance of Allah. This is the night prior to Eid, and it is recommended that one spends it in worship and remembrance of Allah. The du'as recommended above should be read here, especially 
ربنا آتنا في الدنيا حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وقنا عذاب النار. Oh my Lord, grant me goodness in this world and goodness in the next. The following supplication has been narrated from the scholars. اللهم إني أن ترزقني في هذا المكان جوامع الخير كله وأن تصلح شأني كله وأن تصرف عني شر كله فإنه لا يفعل ذلك غيرك ولا يجود به إلا أنت. O oh Allah, surely I ask you to provide for me in this sacred place the gathering together of all goodness and to put right my affair and repel from me all harm. For surely no one can do that other than you, and no one shows that generosity except you. It is sunnah to pray the Fajr prayer early and then to move to the hill known as Al-Mash'ar Al-Haram, if this is possible. One may climb the hill or supplicate at the foot, saying, Allahumma, kama wafaqtana fihi, wara'aytana iyahu, fawafiqana li dhikrik, kama hadaytana, waghfir lana, warhamna kama wa'adtana bi kawlika, wa kawluk al-haq, فإذا أفضت من عرفات فاذكر الله عند المشعر الحرام واذكروه كما هداكم وإن كنت من قبله لمن الضالين ثم أفيد من حيث أفاض الناس واستغفر الله إن الله غفور رحيم O oh Allah, just as you enabled us to this and enabled us to remember you and you guided us, forgive us, show us mercy as you promised us through your words and your words are true, then when you pour down from Mount Arafat, celebrate the praises of Allah at the sacred monument, and celebrate his praises as he has directed you, even though before this you went astray. When leaving the Mash'ar al-Haram, one should continue supplicating and reading the Talbiyah, as this is the last opportunity to make the Talbiyah in the Hajj. When one arrives in Minna, it is recommended to read, Alhamdulillahi alladhi balaghaniha saliman mu'afa, Allah mahadihi minna. قد أعطيتها وأنا عبدك وفي قبضتك أسألك أن تمن علي بما مننت به على أوليائك اللهم إني أعوذ بك من الحرمان والمصيبة في الدين يا أرحم الراحمين All praises to Allah who allowed us to reach it safely and in a good state O oh Allah this is minna We have indeed come and I am your slave in your grasp I ask you to bestow blessings on me as you bestow blessings on your friends. O oh Allah, I seek refuge in you from rejection and tribulations in my religion. O oh most merciful of merciful ones. At Mina, one stones the Jamarat at Aqaba. It is not sunnah to stand to supplicate. If you slaughter your sacrifice yourself at this point, you should say, Bismillah, Wallahu Akbar. اللهم صل على محمد وعلى آله وسلم اللهم منك وإليك تقبل مني In the name of Allah, Allah is greatest. O oh Allah, send prayers and salutations upon Muhammad and his family. O oh Allah, everything is from you and returns to you and so accept this from me. One should exit from Ihram saying Alhamdulillahi ala ma hadana Walhamdulillahi ala ma an'am bihi alayna اللهم هذه ناصيتي فتقبل مني واغفر لي ذنوبي اللهم اغفر لي وللمحلقين والمقصرين يا واسع المغفرة O oh Allah, all praises to Allah for the way he has guided us. All praises to Allah for what he has bestowed upon us. O oh Allah, this is my forelock. O oh Allah, this is my forelock. Accept it from me and forgive my sins. O oh Allah, forgive those who shave their heads and those who cut their hair. O oh Allah, you who is most generous in forgiveness. And after shaving one's head, one should say, Alhamdulillah alladhi qada anna nusukna, Allah mazidna imanan, wa yaqeenan, wa tawfiqan, wa awnan, wa aghfir lana, wa li abaina, wa ummahatina, wa almuslimina ajma'een. All praises to Allah who completed for us the rites, O oh Allah, increase us in faith and certainty and enablement and divine assistance. Forgive us and our forefathers and foremothers and all Muslims. After leaving Ihram, one travels to Mecca to do the tawaf and say. The supplications for this have already been discussed. This only leaves the final days of the Hajj, which are called the days of Tashriq, where the night should be spent in Mina and the Jamarat should be stoned on each of these days.
Imam al nawawi says these days should be spent in remembrance of Allah and he says the best of these remembrance is the act of recitation of Qur'an. When stoning the Jamarat, it is sunnah to face Makkah and praise Allah, glorify Him and state His oneness and then supplicate at each of the first two pillars but not at the third. Before leaving Makkah, one must circumambulate the Kaaba with the intention of Tawaf al wada farewell Tawaf. This should be your last act of worship in Makkah and should be delayed as long as possible. After it, one should supplicate with the following prayer. Allahumma al-baytu baytuka wal-abdu abduka wabnu abdika wabnu amatika hamalatni ala ma sakharta li min khawqika hatta sayyartani fi biladik wabalakhtani bi ni'matika alayya wa'ataytani ala qadai manasika in kunta radita anni fazdad anni rida wa illa fa min al-an qabla an yunadi an baytika dari هذا أوان صرافي إن أذنت لي غير مستبدل بك ولا ببيتك ولا راغبا عنك ولا عن بيتك الله أصحبني العافية في بدني والإسمة في ديني وأحسن من قلبي ورزقني طاعتك ما أبقيتني واجمع لي خير الآخرة واجمع لي خيري الآخرة والدنيا إنك على كل شيء قدير O oh Allah, the house is your house the slave is your slave and the son of your slave You brought me here by making subservient elements of your creation so that I could travel to your land You made me reach your favors and took care of me so I could complete your rights So, if you are pleased with me increase that contentment with me and bless me now before my home calls me away from your house. And do not allow me departure, if you allow me to leave, to be a case of turning my back on you and on your house, or a desire for anything but you and your house. O oh Allah, provide me well-being in my body and protection in my religion, and make all turns of events good for me and provide for me with opportunities for worshipping you for what remains of my life and gather for me the goodness of this world and the next, for surely you have power over all things. May Allah accept your pilgrimage and that of all the Muslims. Amen.